The second IFSC Boulder World Cup in the space of two weeks today brought our climbers to the foot of the mythical Mount Tai and the city of Tai'an. Both the men's and women's finals had a perfect combination of established superstars and a few unknown packages experiencing their first finals. Zhong Wan Chong belongs firmly in the first category, but his two tops and three zones were only enough for sixth place. By taking bronze a few weeks back in Moscow, Gregor Vazonik had already had a dream season regardless of what happened here, but climbing with seemingly little or no pressure, he repeated his result from Russia and claimed his second bronze medal of the year. Yerne Kruder is having the season of his life. He's made every final and only missed one podium thus far. In Tayan, he almost claimed a second win of 2018, but couldn't quite top Boulder 4 and took the silver medal. Alex Kazanov had never made a final before Tayan and was emotional after the semi-finals just for having reached the last round. Little did he realise that he would not only reach the final, but win it. He topped three boulders, which nobody else could match, and now joins the elite group of World Cup winners. This top of boulder four, the only ascent the boulder saw, sealed the deal. Alex was the best climber on the day, and his win was not only popular with so many of the climbing community, but also thoroughly well deserved. Johanna Ferber on the women's side finished an outstanding fifth just behind Stasha Geo, who narrowly missed out on the second podium in the space of a week. Making her third IFSC podium just ahead of Stasha was Fanny Gibert. The French national champion has looked in top form all season and converted that into a bronze medal in Tyan with two tops in the final. She made relatively light work of Boulder 3 and actually topped number 4 but was sadly timed out before she reached the top. As it turned out, it wouldn't have affected her ranking even if she had done it in time. Miho Nanaka has been first, second and second in the first three World Cups of the season and made it a hat-trick of consecutive silver medals in Tai'an. She topped all four boulders but crucially used up too many attempts on boulder three and this ended up costing her. She finished in style with the top of Boulder 4, but again used three attempts to get it. Last time out in Chongqing, Akio Noguchi looked all but unstoppable, and little had changed when she got to Tai'an. She flashed both of the first two boulders with zero fuss to get her final off to a perfect and quick start. Boulder 3 was the only one where she needed more than one attempt, and even then, she got its second go. On Boulder 4, she sealed the deal, fittingly enough, with a flash to seal a truly dominant win. I'm surprised. I did that again. I came out without, without any expectations. I was laughing, I had a smile on my face. And then I climbed. I climbed like I climb outdoors, I climbed with a smile, I climbed without any pressure, any expectations, just pure fun. And I was shocked. And sometimes, believe me, sometimes miracles happen, sometimes dreams come true, and it was this time for me. <laughs>